Welcome back, health and wellness and longevity seekers. Today we're diving deep into a crucial topic that affects millions worldwide, yet often goes unnoticed until it's almost too late. We're talking about kidney health and more specifically, the top 10 signs that your kidneys might cry out for help. Your kidneys are silent warriors, working tirelessly to keep your body balanced. But what happens when these vital organs start to falter? How can you tell if they're struggling before it becomes critical? In this video, we'll explore the subtle changes and more noticeable symptoms. That could indicate your kidneys are in distress. Understanding these signs could be life-saving, empowering you to take action before severe damage occurs. So let's embark on this journey of discovery and arm ourselves with knowledge that could protect our health for years to come. Our first sign is one that many of us might brush off as just a busy lifestyle catching up with us, fatigue and weakness. So here's the thing, when your kidneys aren't functioning at their best, they can't effectively clean your blood. This buildup of toxins can leave you feeling drained as if you've run a marathon just getting out of bed. It's not just about being tired, it's a bone deep exhaustion that doesn't improve with rest. This fatigue is often linked to anemia, a common complication of kidney disease. Healthy kidneys produce a hormone called erythropoietin, which signals your body to make red blood cells. When kidney function declines, so does the production of this hormone, leading to a decrease in red blood cells and the oxygen they carry throughout your body. The result, a persistent feeling of exhaustion that no amount of sleep seems to cure. Now let's talk about something you might notice in the bathroom. No, it's not pleasant, but essential, foamy urine. It might sound strange, but it could be a red flag if your urine consistently looks like a frothy latte. This foam is often a sign of protein in your urine, a condition called proteinuria. Healthy kidneys should keep protein in your blood where it belongs, not let it escape into your urine. When kidneys are damaged, they may start allowing proteins, especially one called albumin, to leak into your urine. This protein creates the foam, much like how egg whites can make a meringue. It's not just a visual oddity, it's a sign that your kidney's filtration system is compromised. If you notice this consistently, bringing it up with your healthcare provider is crucial. Next, let's talk about a silent threat that's all too common, high blood pressure. Your kidneys and blood pressure have a close relationship. When your kidneys struggle, they can't regulate your blood pressure as effectively. This can lead to a vicious cycle where high blood pressure further damages your kidneys. It's like a silent storm brewing in your body and you might not feel it until significant damage has been done. Kidneys play a vital role in regulating blood pressure by controlling the amount of fluid in the bloodstream and producing essential hormones. When they're not functioning correctly, blood pressure can rise, putting additional strain on the heart and blood vessels. The tricky part is that high blood pressure often has no symptoms, so it's usually called the silent killer. Regular blood pressure checks are crucial, especially if you have other risk factors for kidney disease. Now take a deep breath. No, take a deep breath. It could be another sign of kidney trouble if you find yourself short of breath, especially after minimal exertion. When your kidneys can't keep up with filtering waste, fluid can build up in your lungs, making it feel like you're breathing through a straw. This symptom is often overlooked, but it's a critical indicator that your body's filtration system might fail. This shortness of breath can be particularly noticeable when you're lying down. You might find yourself needing to prop up your head with extra pillows to breathe comfortably at night. It's not just about being out of shape, your body tells you something's off balance internally. If you notice this symptom, especially with swelling in your legs or ankles, it's time to consult your doctor. Let's talk about something a bit more noticeable, changes in your skin. If you find yourself itching constantly and no amount of lotion seems to help, your kidneys might be the culprit. As waste builds up in your blood, it can cause severe itching. It's not just annoying, it's your body's way of telling you something's off balance internally. This itching, medically known as uremic pruritus, can occur all over the body or in specific areas, particularly on the back, arms and legs. It's often described as a crawling sensation just beneath the skin. The itching can be so intense that it disrupts sleep and affects quality of life. While dry skin can contribute to the problem, the root cause is the buildup of waste products in your blood that your kidneys are failing to filter out. Here's a symptom that might surprise you. A metallic taste in your mouth and bad breath that won't go away no matter how much you brush. It's not just about skipping your dental checkup. When your kidneys can't filter waste properly, it can build up in your blood and alter your taste buds. It's like your body is trying to tell you something's off, one unpleasant taste at a time. 
This metallic taste, sometimes described as having pennies in your mouth, is caused by a buildup of uremic toxins, substances that healthy kidneys usually filter out. Along with the bad taste, foods don't taste right, decreasing appetite. This can contribute to another problem common in kidney disease, malnutrition. Let's shift gears to something you might notice in your daily routine, changes in your urination patterns. Are you running to the bathroom more often? Or maybe you're hardly going at all? Both can be signs of kidney issues. Your kidneys play a crucial role in producing urine. So when they're not working right, it can throw your whole system off balance. Frequent urination can be an early sign of kidney disease, especially at night. Conversely, decreased urine output can indicate that your kidneys have trouble producing urine. You might also notice changes in the color of your urine. It might be darker or even blood tinged. Any persistent changes in your urination patterns warrant conversing with your healthcare provider. Now let's discuss a symptom that's hard to ignore, swelling, especially in your ankles, feet, and hands. This puffiness, also known as edema, happens when your kidneys can't remove excess fluid from your body. It's like your body is retaining water, but not in a good way. If you notice your shoes feeling tight or rings getting snug, it's time to pay attention. This swelling occurs because your kidneys can't maintain the right balance of fluids in your body. As excess fluid builds up in your tissues, you might notice that pressing on the swollen area leaves a small dent for a few seconds. This is called pitting edema and is a clear sign that fluid retention is occurring. While there can be other causes of edema and other symptoms on our list, it's a strong indicator of potential kidney problems. Here's a symptom that might seem unrelated but is closely tied to kidney function, difficulty concentrating and dizziness. When your kidneys aren't filtering waste effectively, Toxins can build up in your blood and affect your brain. It's like trying to think through a fog, frustrating and potentially dangerous if left unchecked. This cognitive impact, sometimes called kidney brain, can manifest as trouble with memory, focus, and even sleep patterns. You might need help to concentrate at work or remember simple tasks. The dizziness can make you feel off balance and increase your risk of falls. These symptoms are a stark reminder of how interconnected our body systems are and how crucial kidney function is to our overall well-being. Our final sign brings us full circle to where we started, but with a twist. Remember how we talked about fatigue? Sometimes kidney problems can also manifest as difficulty sleeping. It seems counterintuitive. You're exhausted but can't sleep. This insomnia can be caused by the buildup of waste products in your blood that your kidneys should filter out. Sleep problems related to kidney disease can take various forms. You might have trouble falling asleep, wake up frequently during the night, or experience restless leg syndrome, an irresistible urge to move your legs that can keep you awake. Poor sleep quality can exacerbate other symptoms like fatigue and difficulty concentrating, creating a cycle that's hard to break without addressing the underlying kidney issues. Now let's take a moment to reflect on these 10 signs. Each one on its own might not scream kidney problem, but together, they paint a picture of an internal system crying out for help. The beauty of our bodies is that they often warn us before things get critical. The key is learning to listen and act. It's important to note that other health conditions can also cause these symptoms. However, suppose you're experiencing several of them, especially if you have risk factors like diabetes, high blood pressure, or a family history of kidney disease. In that case, it's crucial to get checked out Early detection can make a difference in managing kidney disease and preventing its progression. So what can you do if you recognize some of these signs in yourself or a loved one? First and foremost, don't panic. Many of these symptoms can be caused by other conditions. However, it's crucial not to ignore them. The next step is to schedule an appointment with your healthcare provider. They can run tests to check your kidney function and determine if there's cause for concern. These tests might include blood tests to measure creatinine and blood urea nitrogen bun levels, which can indicate how well your kidneys are filtering waste. A urine test can check for protein or blood in your urine, which can show kidney damage. Your doctor might also recommend imaging tests like ultrasounds or CT scans to examine your kidney structure closely. In the meantime, there are steps you can take to support your kidney health. Stay hydrated. Water is your kidney's best friend. Aim for about eight glasses daily, but let your thirst guide you. Watch your salt intake as too much sodium can stress your kidneys. The American Heart Association recommends no more than 2300 milligrams daily with an ideal limit of 1500 milligrams for most adults. 
If you have conditions like diabetes or high blood pressure, managing them effectively can also protect your kidney function. Control your blood sugar levels and take any prescribed medications as directed. Regular exercise can help manage these conditions and support overall kidney health. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate activity most days of the week. Your diet plays a crucial role in kidney health too. Focus on eating plenty of fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. These foods are rich in antioxidants and other nutrients that support kidney function. Limit processed foods, often high in sodium and phosphorus, two minerals that can be hard on the kidneys when consumed in excess. Remember, your kidneys are incredible organs that work hard to keep you healthy. By paying attention to these signs and taking action early, you can help ensure they continue to do their job effectively for years to come. Kidney disease is often called a silent killer because it can progress without obvious symptoms until it's pretty advanced. That's why awareness of these subtle signs and acting on them is crucial. As we end this video, I encourage you to be proactive about your kidney health. Take action before multiple symptoms appear. Your health is in your hands and knowledge is your most powerful tool. Regular checkups, a healthy lifestyle, and staying attuned to your body's signals can go a long way in preventing kidney disease or catching it early when it's most treatable. If you found this information helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and share it with friends and family who might benefit from this knowledge. Subscribe to our channel for more health and wellness insights to help you live your best life. Remember, your journey to optimal health is ongoing and we're here to support you every step of the way. Thank you for joining us today on this deep dive into kidney health. Until next time, stay informed, proactive, and most importantly, healthy.